Hi guys, and um, today we are just going to take a quick look at my Gear 4 case. Now I think this is the Crystal Palace version. I will have to double check, but I will put it in the description down below anyway. So as you can tell, it's kind of like a, a shimmery type case, so it just changes colour and everything. Obviously this isn't included, this is my rinky card holder again. Um, you've got the, you've got like the D30, you know, typical Gear 4 branding on there. You've got Gear 4 right on the bottom, which you can't quite really see. Then you've got your cutout for the mute switch, you've got your volume up and down, camera cutout, all your cutouts on the bottom. Pretty much standard. So, obviously green iPhone. Let's just pop this in. Now I do find this case a bit hard to to like take on and off just because I find that the it seems to like stick to the to the iPhone and it just makes it look like it's got wet. That's the only way I can explain it, but that's how it looks and it's got a bit of a a raised bit for the camera so it's not touching the table which I prefer um, and then you've got your cutouts on there you've got your cut out there for that now the only thing I don't like about this is the fact that it doesn't quite come on the screen as like as far as the Tech 21's I just feel like it's it's just sitting on the edge and it is like a, a bit of a hard, a hard plastic as well, but other than that, you know, it's got the raised bit on the back, but none of that really bothers me because I have this on, so that gives me a bit of extra raisivity on the back. But anyway, that's just a quick look at the Gear 4 case that I have up to now. Please like and subscribe and thanks for watching.